Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to determine the Lewis structure for ASF3 molecule. It is a chemical formula for arsenic trifluoride and to look at its Lewis structure we will first need to know the total number of valence electrons for this molecule. So here we have one atom of arsenic which has 5 valence electrons in its outer shell and 3 atoms of fluorine and each fluorine atom has 7 valence electrons in its outer, sh outer shell. So in total we have 26 valence electrons for ASF3. Now here arsenic will take the uh, central position and fluorine atoms will be arranged around it as fluorine atoms are more electronegative than the arsenic atom. Once you have done that, place a pair of electrons between each fluorine and arsenic atom to show a chemical bond. Now placing 3 pairs, we will be using up 6 out of 26 valence electrons over here and the rest of the electrons will be arranged around first fluorine atoms and then the arsenic atom. Now if you look at the fluorine atoms over here, each fluorine atom already has 2 valence electrons and it just needs 6 more. So we are going to place 6 valence electrons around each fluorine atoms which means we are using up more 18 electrons and we are just left with the 2. And these electrons, these 2 electrons will be placed on the arsenic atom because it can have 2 more electrons to complete its octet and after doing that we have used up all our valence electrons all 26 of them and there are complete octates for each atom in this structure so this is the lewis structure of arsenic trifluoride in which there are three single bonds formed and there are um, there is a lone pair of electron on the central arsenic atom i hope this video helps you to understand the lewis structure for asf3 and for more such videos on lewis structure molecular geometry polarity of the molecules make sure to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching